Uh, the, the players went through a number of fields for Chris because he's such a dangerous player. Um, but the, the key thing to acknowledge was how the wicket was going to play and also if you win the toss. We, we felt in our first game here the wicket was a little bit sticky and offered a little bit to the bowlers. Um, so when we found that that was the case today, we had a few more attacking options. So the first uh, effort is to try and get Chris out maybe LBW or with a full swinging one uh, and then there's there's other plans that work from there so it's really the players working out based on the, the conditions the wicket conditions and, and what how best they think they can get Chris out early. Well it, it sort of snuck up on us a little bit but he's been um, he's been absolutely the heartbeat of, of CSK there's no doubt about it whether it's performances or guidance or leadership um, and and you sort of run out of things to say about him, but his longevity is also something now that is um, to, to be appreciated and and mentioned. But um, to play the 200 games and still have a desire to do well and and perform well is a testament to, to his attitude, firstly towards the game, but also to the franchise as well. I think that the franchise has grown and MS has grown with it, so it's a very good relationship and a great fit. Well, I'm, I'm really impressed with the way he bounced back after the first game. We we felt within our group that the conditions sort of transpired against us a little bit with the drizzle and the and the dew and we weren't able to create any opportunities so the challenge was laid down uh, to the bowling group as to how they were going to operate a little bit better in today's conditions and, and winning the toss I think is important to acknowledge so there was some assistance there and without doubt when Deepak gets a little bit of swing and a little bit of movement he's um, he's one of the finest around so his ability to to swing the ball is one, um, but his control and also his skill set is is very high. So the, the key really is is keeping him um, a little bit simple in his plans and just operating in and around the stumps because he's so effective when he has the ball swinging. Today was a, a great example of of the skills he has. And as I say, a great bounce back from a, 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 a probably a, a below par performance in the first game. Well, it's the best eleven. You. you put in a performance like this then it's hard to argue but yeah we, we only have one we have Lungi and Gidi who now becomes available but he's only out in the next couple of days so uh, we'll see how he comes out of quarantine but the performance today from the 11 um, was very encouraging and, and now it's a case of, of really assessing the conditions I think everyone thought they were going to be high scoring um, slogathons but now there's a little bit more art to the team you pick and the, the, the tactics that you use so uh, we're really happy about that. We, we like the opportunity when there's a bit in the wicket to um, to work hard and a bit of blue collar. So we, we, we're really encouraged by today's performance and the, the way that the 11 played. No, I'm really happy with the, the balance we've got there. Ruta Raj, I think, is a fine player. Um, and he got a good ball in the first innings and very difficult conditions today. It, it's not a 220 wicket today. It's um, it's much different. And the way they, they fought that out, I was very pleased. He's a young player that... Uh, we showed faith in last year and, and his talent came through. So, uh, look, our, our philosophy when we, we pick players and put them in the team is to really back them. And, um, and this combination is certainly that.